Mm. Eric, you made um, many interviews with many successful people. Mm -hmm. What gives you uh, this interview, personally? What did I get from them? Yeah. Uh, What yeah, experience? A, a lot of these people are friends. Yeah. Uh, over time, you know, mm -hmm. uh, most of the people I talk to, I have history with, you know, and and I really admire them because they're smart. They've been very very good at what they do. They help a lot of people, whether it's in personal development or or leadership or or those types of things. Um, it's a combination of things. One is I want to educate them. Mm -hmm on how great network marketing is. Two, I want them to, because I know what they feel about our profession, I want them to help educate the world uh, about what it is that we yeah. have to offer, right? So uh, sometimes when you say, oh, here's this author of this book, like Jack Canfield or something, mm -hmm. you know, success principles, and yeah. very, very powerful, successful guy. When he talks about how great network marketing is, People may be tired of hearing me talk about it, yeah. but then they hear him talk about it. Or they hear Tony Robbins, or they hear Ryan Tracy, or Les Brown, or any of these people talk about how great it is. Um, it, it makes me proud more than anything. Yes, you know and that we're that we're again we're early. Yeah, early, 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 early. It's like the pioneers' early stage um, of of where our profession is going to go. You know, and the people I think that support it are the people that. Uh, endorse it, the people who um, uh, are kind to it, I think they, they get, they understand it and they get rewarded from that, you know? Yeah. So it's, uh, it's been a lot of fun and we're just starting. I mean, we're, we've got uh, some interesting things coming in the next year, some bigger names and some wow. powerful people and yeah, it's a good time. Eric, and uh, which interview, which uh, person um, more valuable uh, for you? Um, and uh, who influenced um, uh, to you uh, more than others? Well, uh, yeah, I my my biggest influence yes. is Jim Rohn, probably. Jim Rohn, yeah. okay, uh, yeah, he's he was an amazing yes. guy, and he was a friend, and um, he helped me develop a philosophy for life. He helped me with life skills, yeah, um, to develop myself as a young man. Um, And Jim Rohn influenced Tony Robbins, and Tony Robbins is somebody I greatly admire and, yeah. and respect and enjoy working with, and uh, he's coming and speaking at our event. I uh, saw this uh, interview with uh, yeah. Tony Robbins. Yeah, and, and uh, um, you know, powerful guy. Yeah. Um, you know, very successful, powerful guy. So you know, I really enjoy that relationship a lot. I think he can bring a lot of value. Um, but all of them, you know, for yeah. different reasons, whether it's uh, Jack Canfield or Brian Tracy or... Les Brown, Harry Dent, uh, Paul Pilzer, these are all incredibly smart, bright, interesting people. Yeah. Um, so, you know, every time I'm around them, they, they challenge me to think a little different, think a little bigger, think a little stronger. Um, you know, all of them were my heroes. You know, I had them on audio programs yeah. in my car, listening over and over and over again. Uh, so to be able to work with them is uh, is pretty amazing. Um, but again, like I say, all of us have a responsibility. I like what you're doing, you know, with, with taking these and getting it to, to people who need to hear it. Because uh, sometimes you just need to hear another voice. Oh, that person wrote a book. That person was successful with this. And look what they have to say. Yeah. Ah, so you have a little third party it's, something, you know. It's a different point of view. A different point yeah. of view, different words. Or sometimes it's just credibility. Yeah. You know, you get somebody, you know, look how advertising works. You, you take uh, a top tennis star, you know, uh, Roger Federer says, hey, try this product. And everybody goes, oh, great. They go crazy. Uh, <laughs> yeah. and it's like, he, he might, he's just holding it. That's yeah, all he's yeah. doing. And he's holding it. It's like, well, okay. But that's how we're, we're, we're yeah. wired. Sometimes when, when um, so a person with credibility talks favorably about what we're doing, It, it changes our posture a little bit, yeah. makes us a little bit more proud. Yeah. You know? so. And um, about um, achievements, mm -hmm. I want to ask a question. Uh, what uh, three of your biggest achievements in life can you share with this? Um, well, you know, personally, yeah. personally, it's my family, my wife. Yeah. Um, uh, you know, that th those are my things that I'm that have given me the most joy. 
Yeah. Um, but professionally, if I'm just talking professionally, one is the decision to be a professional. And it took me three or four years to decide of being involved in network marketing. Mm -hmm. When I decided to be a professional, that was important. Mm -hmm. That was a big, big turning point for me and something that I'm proud that I did. Um, uh, two, I, I would say that uh, the book GoPro, you know, which because I, I'm not a writer, but I needed to, to tell the story. The fact that that's a million copies around the world in a lot of different languages, that makes me feel good. You know, it makes me feel uh, I've made a contribution in into the marketplace. And probably third, just the Network Marketing Pro community. Um, that we're again we're very very early but we're doing something that's never been done mm -hmm. as far as on a so big true. scale yeah. yeah doing something bold uh, for our profession and and uh, serving our profession and working with these incredible people around the world um, I'm really proud of that so far and uh, and yeah I, I would say we're we haven't even really started really I mean, we're just, the, what we've done so far, everybody's saying, oh, it's amazing. That's just because nobody else has done anything. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Uh, and who's done something amazing in network marketing as far as supporting it? Yeah. Not very many people. The bar is set really low. You know, so the fact that we're doing some stuff, eh, it's okay. Yeah. But look at what great leaders in the world have done. And if we apply that same mindset or principle mm -hmm. and think bigger, and bolder inside of our profession, um, I think we can do something spectacular. So, um, so yeah, it, it, you know, those those types of things uh, make me happy. It makes me happy that more people are calling themselves network marketing professionals nowadays. This makes me happy that people are feeling a little stronger and working on their skills. Uh, it makes me, you know, proud that uh, together we're doing something. It's and it's not even like I'm something special. I'm just organizing it. You know, kind of creating a playground that everybody gets to play on. Yeah. Um, and if somebody comes in and does better than me, fantastic. You know, yeah, wonderful. Push me. You know? <laughs> yeah. Push me. Let's let's uh, let's all grow together. Yeah. Uh, now, so many people talk about success, uh, talk about financial success, and um, what uh, what means success for you personally? Success for me is about growth and contribution. Growth. And Okay. Yeah. Money comes as a result of contribution, yes, yes. I think. The more you contribute, the more you, you give intelligently. Yeah. Um, you can give yourself to death with no boundaries and just give everything to oh. everybody and, yeah. and, and, and not be any good to the world uh, other than those people that you gave to. What I'm, what I'm talking about is contributing to the world. Finding a way to contribute to the world makes me happy. Growth makes me happy. Um, what I like to say is progress is perfection. You know, just don't worry about being perfect. Just worry about being better yeah. than you were yesterday. And better again and better again and better again. So for us, we're not driven by money. Um, we Money's important to be able to, to do things to another level. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And there's nothing wrong with money at all. Uh, it's okay for a person to go out there and earn. But I, what I would say is if I'm growing, I'm happy. Mm -hmm. If I'm contributing, I'm happy. Yeah. Um, that's that's uh, the biggest for me. And, and can I contribute bigger, on a bigger scale, mm -hmm. and can I become better? And I hope every day, every year, I'm getting a little better. Um, I'm better at communicating, better at training, better at organizing things, better at uh, putting the events on that we do, or, or uh, you know, anything that we do, just as long as we get a little bit better. So it, for me, it's, um, it's growth and contribution.